Welcome to my channel viewers please endeavor to like, share and subscribe so you will be the first to view latest new informations. Conservative lawyer George Conway warned that Donald Trump will act extra frantically after Wednesday's bombshell ruling via a federal judge that located the former president probable dedicated crimes such as Walsh in office. To the different huge story we refer to involving crook legal responsibility for the former president, a federal decide in California these days ordered emails became over to the January 6 committee, announcing they point out the former president knew his voter fraud claims were incorrect, however pushed them anyway, CNN's Anderson Cooper. For analysis, the anchor interviewed Conway and Alyssa Farrah Griffin, who served as director of strategic communications in Trump's White. Conway said, this is a smoking gun for the prosecutor in Georgia, and the Georgia investigation is very advanced. This is going to be a very necessary report and show off in the fees that I'm certain she's going to bring. Griffin cited she had heard Trump bitch about the truth he had lost the 2020 presidential election to Joe Biden. So the truth is most humans round Trump, which include Trump himself, knew he lost, however they desire to desperately hang to strength in any way they could, she said. I would agree with George, I do assume this is the closest component to a smoking gun in simply deliberate wrongdoing. A form of reeks of desperation, Griffin said. I assume he is in a location he feels cornered in a variety of extraordinary investigations. This man is cornered at each and every flip, and he is not surrounded via smart criminal counsel, so suppose you will see an addition acts of desperation from him," she said. Conway stated Trump would be unable to block the emails from being passed over to the House Select Committee investigating the January 6 attack on the US Capitol. This is going to be used towards him, and it is a devastating, as I said, a devastating piece of evidence," Conway said. I agree with Alyssa, he is a determined man, and he is getting extra and extra desperate, he continued, on U.S. Attorney General Merrick Garland to investigation threats against providers of gender transition-related medical care for youth, asserting ongoing hostility, including bomb threats and threats of personal violence. The letter, dated October 3, says medical providers are facing threats for providing evidence-based health care to youth, which has meant care for gender transitions, such as hormones, puberty blockers and gender reassignment surgery. The targets of these threats, the letter says, are children's hospitals, academic health systems and physicians across the country. These coordinated attacks threaten federally protected rights to health care for patients and their families, the letter says. The attacks are rooted in an intentional campaign of disinformation, where a few high-profile users on social media share false and misleading information targeting individual physicians and hospitals, resulting in a rapid escalation of threats, harassment and disruption of care across multiple jurisdictions.